In this video, I'm going to show you how to build a cross tab. So to build a cross tab in Tableau, you just drag your measure into the view pane. And then let's say, let's look at for different segments. You drag your segment into the columns or into the rows. That's how to build a cross tab in Tableau. Now we're looking at cells for each segment. And of course we could add something like, let's say region. Now we're looking at cells for each segment and each region. If all you want to do is just view your data, you don't have to build a cross tab you can just click on this button right here and view all your data and if you have calculated fields your calculated fields are going to show up here when you view data and by default tableau only shows you the first 10,000 rows but you could make changes and maybe say only the first five rows now it's only showing you five rows and you, have, you can drag this and move it around so if you wanted to put things side by side and just get a view of your data you could do that whatever changes you make here doesn't affect your underlying data so this is a quick way to just view your data so if all you need to do is view your data you don't have to build a cross tab but cross tab is very useful like whenever whenever you want to build a table for reference you can easily do it using a cross tab so if we want to build a table that shows us the cells and also that shows us the cells forecast for each segment and region we can use a, a cross tab to do that. So I just grab sales forecast and drag it over here and add sales forecast to this cross tab right here. And once you do that, you see measure values and measure names filter here. From measure names filter, you can do edit filter and you can add more measure filter. So let's say we also want to look at profit and also we want to look at quantity for each one so we just choose those and we click ok and profit and quantity will be added to our cross tab and they will also be added to measure values so the way this is set up right here is showing you for each segment and for each region in each segment, this is the profit, the quantity, the sales, and the sales forecast. All right. Now let's just take quantity out. To take something out. You just take it and remove it. That's how you take things out of your cross tab. And of course, you could uh, move things around. So we can switch from this view to this view like this now we are saying for um the region of the, for central region and for each segment this is the profit this is the sales sales and this is the sales forecast so we can easily easily build a cross tab like this and have a reference reference data and be able to quickly and easily see things And of course, you can you can extend your table by doing something like this, or you can build a different view where you take measure names from columns and add it to rows. Now, basically, you are saying for central region and for the consumer segment, this is their profit, this is their sales, and this is their sales forecast. Now, of course, you can move this around 
to have different views. Well, it looks like I lost one. <laughs> I accidentally got rid of one. But anyway, so that's basically it. But I liked it the way it was before. Kanjima Corporate, Home Office, and I think it was Region that we had. Yeah, I liked it the way it was before. So, and of course, you can take things and move it around if you like. So you can put um, sales forecast first, and then you can put sales. Or you can also do it from here, drag it from sales to here, and that will also change things. So you can also change things around. And you can sort by having uh, the sales, this one with the highest sales forecast is um, the consumer region in the West. The consumer segment in the Western region has the highest sales forecast. Now, some people may want to have grid lines on their table like this. To add a grid line to your cross tab in Tableau, you just right click and you go to format. And from here you, you click on borders and it says cells none. So here we click on cell on cell. Choose the type of border that we want and choose a color for it. And just like that, we just added grid lines to our stuff. Let's make it black and let's make it bold. And maybe add one for our pens too. That's if you had pens and um, maybe add one for headers. So that's the basics of how to add lines to your cross tab in Tableau. And of course, there's many different changes you could make here. So you can just play around with this until you get it exactly the way you want it to look. That's how you build a cross tab in Tableau.